What's up, you guys? This is Zach Jack Dan back with another Every DC video. This time we're talking about Every McFarlane Toys Dark Knight's Metal. And this is kind of wave two that he has coming out. We will see. So, if you saw my previous video, I had potentially what wave two was going to be because of a sales receipt that was got from EB Games. And we talked about all these figures before. So we already knew about the White Knight figures and the Arkham figures and also the Wonder Woman figures that they revealed at the Toy Fair 2020. But the crazy thing is uh, somebody got a EB Games pre-order or pre-sale for the Series 2 McFarlane stuff. So it's interesting what this list consisted of. So we'll go through that here in a second. So I found on a website, ohmyprimus.com, uh, that he has a listing for the Dark Knight's Metal McFarlane Toys 7-inch August release. And here is the Grim Knight figure that he's showing off here as if it's a McFarlane toy. So take it as you will. He's the only one that has the pictures out there. Whether McFarlane gave it to him or not, I don't know. But there's what he looks like. And then this is from my previous video showing what he could look like. And what the Grim Knight actually is, with all his guns and whatnot. So we'll see. I didn't see any guns on the the McFarlane toys from the first page there from their website. Jumping back over to the website again, he has the Devastator from Dark Knight's Metal. This guy is massive, so this would be the biggest one he's done yet. So again, here is my previous video what I showed as Devastator. Does he look like the statue, which is amazing? No. Does he look like the comic book? Yes. So we'll see. Next, we don't have much of a picture of this murder machine here. It doesn't show the face or the legs, the rest of the legs or anything like that. So we'll see what this actually looks like. And he's got several different looks that he could go with. So uh, we'll see what he does with that. This is from a previous video as well. And then we have Dawnbreaker on the website to pre-order, ohmyprimus.com. It's O-H-M-Y-P-R-I-M-U-S. And then from my previous video, just kind of talking about Dawnbreaker and who he was. And the last one that's on the website is the Dark Knight's Metal Red Death. Not a bad looking figure, but... This was from our previous video of a statue and of the comic book itself. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what it looks like whenever McFarlane does it. So now I'm going to kind of roll back into my previous video with the rest of what the wave is supposedly going to look like. So I'll leave you there. So then we also have the Thomas Wayne as Batman in the Flashpoint. So that would be very interesting to see that one coming in. Then the only thing uh, that we have that's not Batman related is the modern Flash. And of course Batman related again is the modern Joker. And then again related to Batman is the Red Hood. Not sure which version it'll be. You got the possible Arkham Knight version, armored version, leather jacket version, not sure. And then they said they're also going to give us a 7-inch figure and vehicle. That'll be about 50 bucks. I'm not sure what that'll be either. So what you guys think about this potential list? Would you be interested in this from the McFarlane brand? Let me know in the comments. I'm very interested in all kinds of Batman stuff, but for this to be an entire wave, maybe a little overkill. I'm not sure. Hit that comment. Hit that uh, notification bell. The... Uh, thumbs up and all that good stuff and I will talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.